Hey guys, I'm gonna make a super quick tutorial today. If you are using Fruity Loops 12 on a Mac on Windows 8.1, which is what I'm running, um, the plugins are too small. So I'll just show you a quick example. Uh, I'll load up FM8, which is uh, complete, made by Native Instruments, and you can see that relative to everything else, like the mixer, it's just way too small, and I can hardly, you know, you can't really work in that uh, that small of a screen. So, a quick fix. I don't know if there's any better options. Uh, sorry, I'm recording off my phone. I know it's shaky. A uh, quick fix that I found was to go to the processing tab, uh, which is over here in the wrapper settings, and you click processing, and you click make bridged and also make sure external window is highlighted. Then when you open the plugin, it's the regular size. And the way you can make sure this happens every time is after you do that, you go over here, let's say we're working with a, so this is a generator. So let's say we want to save it. I, I saved it under synth special. So go back to your plugin, FM8, uh, and if you save add plugin to database as flag as favorite, now every time you go to uh, insert, and then we have synth special, which is what I just did. Now every time I open FM8, it's big. Uh, it's the regular size it should be, and that's for all. I just did. I just pretty much did that for all my plugins. So now like synth plant, everything's the right size, and I even did it for all my effects. So you can do the same thing. Um, ooh, no, see, I have a see, I have a section I named called Bridge. So that's what the regular acoustics looks like, the regular plugin. But then if I go to Bridged, and I saved it as to open as a Bridge plugin, it's the regular size. So I hope this helps, guys. Let me know if you have any questions.